It's time for the A break, 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 break down. Coming live right now. What's going on, y'all? This is Ross Bagley, and you're listening to The Breakdown with my homies Dave and Oddly. Breakdown. If you enjoyed the 90s TV show The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, you will know our featured guest. He played little Nicky Banks, and now he's all grown up. Here he is, Ross Bagley. Thanks for joining us. Hey, man, my pleasure. Hey, this is hot, man. Ross in the house, man. Thanks for being here, man. This is cool. <laughs> yes, sir, man. Any time. Yeah. Um, as far as it goes out in the public, not as much anymore because I look a little different. You know, I didn't have a mustache back then, so. so yeah. <laughs> That's a little That's just a four-year-old with a mustache. Yeah. <laughs> hey, there's much McDonald's, though. You might start seeing them in a minute. <laughs> no kidding. That, that cast was awesome. Just to, just to start off there, I mean, we really got treated like a family, and that stems from Will Smith. I'm, I'm not going to even lie to you. I mean, that's just how he gets down. You know, they always say the people highest up at the top are some of the nicest people, and and he is really a testament to that statement. Um, but his, his kindness just bled throughout the past, and um, one of the funniest moments that I can remember is us actually having a food fight at on the very last day of shooting we had a cake brought and the set was all clean and you know we were we were moving out on the show if you may remember and the set was just like pretty much empty and they brought a big old cake out and i was a kid you know i'm I'm like eight years old so i had always wanted to have a food fight you know i wasn't going to public (laughs) school and stuff so i always wanted to have a food fight and i remember will just threw the cake at somebody and it was on and i was like man this was the life you know (laughs) No doubt. It's definitely tough. I mean, it's not supposed to be easy, but luckily we've got 16 championships to uh, show forth that we can beat the odds. Um, So I'm saying we've done it. We've been there. And please stay tuned because we'll be there again. Let's go. That was such a hater move by the NBA. I was just so, I was aghast when I heard that they were just going to block the, the trade and all the owners was like, occupy David Stern's office. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. let's not let this go down.